Okay. Welcome back in, everybody. Golf Talk Radio with Mike Billy. Thank you to Dr. Ryan McGowey and Tascadero with McGowey Health Group. 805-461-8822, HealthySlowCounty.com. McGowey Health Group uh, sponsoring also the golf ball giveaway that we'll do here through Fantasy Golf uh, with Bridgestone Golf Balls brought to you by McGowey Health Group. 805-461-8822. Feel better, live better, McGowey Health Group. All right. So right before we went to break, I read this scam letter and this it's this which I knew it was a, we talked during the break and it was a different scam. I knew that they were searching for information. I had no idea deal it could be a financial scam or whatever. But I brought it up because who's going to, you know, how much is too much input in lessons? 2 hours a day for 14 straight days of input. <laughs> I mean, come on people. So I'm asking you as in real if you had a student come to you and said, I'm going to be in town for three days, I like to get a lesson each day, and then i got to get out of town. And what, is your, what would you do? I mean, is that too much? Is that perfect, Jim? Is that, I mean, we're all different. What would you recommend? Well, we've had a lot of golf schools come through. Um, I, the golf schools are at, I meant private. So more I private, know, but that's yeah. kind of the situation, like, okay. because they're here for three days. They'll come in. Some of them hardly play any golf. The first question I ask to them right away is, you want three days, okay? You're going to be here with lunch, three to five hours a day of instruction. So, how many days in a row have you played 18 holes? The most. That's the first thing I ask, and I know right away what we're up against by their answers. I play six times a year. That's right. Mm. That could be. I know. And so I basically, with my guys and me, we try to move to short game as much as possible. Because they're going to get yeah. killed. And, I and, think, I, and a lot of stretching and a lot and of rest. I think the question, I might have rested it wrong, because Mike and I, we've done a lot, of, a lot of three-day academies or, or, you know, yeah. or, or stuff. And, and yes, you're teaching each a little bit each day, and they play, and they have lunch. And it's, it's a, it, you know, it's, it's a, we used to do night clinics and putting in the evening yeah. and stuff. That I meant, cool. what if someone bought a series of lessons from you? They're here, you go, I want a series of six lessons, and I want to take a lesson each day. Six days. Now, not that they're in town just for those six days, but here's a series of lessons, but I'd like to meet you at 12 o'clock every day for the next six days. Would you guys say, let's go for it? If I absolutely had to, I would, I would do it, but I would take an, a section of each section of the game each day. So I would do irons one day, I'd do putting one day, I'd do chipping one day, pitching one day, and I'd break it up like that. Would you do if it? If they absolutely said, I want to do it irregardless, that's what I would Well, do. my first priority would be, can we take day offs in between? That's my first priority. They don't say that. Well, you're big with rest, Jim. You know I'm I know. I like the day yeah. offs in between. It's like weightlifting. But they said they're only there for no, X they're, no, they're not there. Just, they're not only, but they just, that's what they want. Oh. They, they live down the street. Gotta, they live on Bogey yeah. Street, just a sand wedge from your Then park. I wouldn't. So, I do that yeah, way. so it's not somebody just coming. I thought in. it was somebody coming. So in because for, if that's that's a separate situation, yeah, yeah. and you're you're accommodating someone. Right. But if they're you're you're just somebody who wants a series of lessons. I'm learning this game. I want to learn it fast. I'm going to take six state six days, or even a series of three. I want three straight days of lessons. Is that something that you guys would accommodate? I would just pick one subject that they have the most issue with and, and attack it for three days if that's what they wanted, and that's all I would do. I would I would mm -hmm. make sure we're successful with that one subject. So you, and would, you wouldn't sure. bounce around for no way for six no three, way. Three different things. No. And Mike, would you take that? Unless on? they ask. Would, Say again. Would, if you were got somebody well, series of three, I know you're doing series of four up there with your thing, right? Would you do four days in a row? No. I wouldn't either. No. Even if they I, wanted that. No. I wouldn't. Because I don't think it's beneficial to the student. No. That but you're like, well, you just the customer's always right. Well, it's not it's not really. <laughs> well, because it's it's our it's a, all arrangements it should be a win win. Right. And I, if I'm going to teach somebody, I want it to be. So it, it's, it, but how much practice in between? Are you, are you going to work on something for the next, you know, come back three hours in the evening and work on something or do, you know, how much in between time is? But if they only come for one hour each day, boom, boom, and leave, or 45 minutes, or whatever your lesson is. I just care. I wouldn't do it. I'd say no. It's no just, that's six, just me. No, it was six lessons. No. Yeah. No, I, mean, I wouldn't even do this. You know, what is your recommended time between lessons? I usually say like what you said. I'll say, give yourself a couple times to go out, e experiment, or work on what we talked about, and come back with some questions or some things yeah. that you found out, or you know, or let's just come back and talk so about what you experienced. Some development time yeah. between the in input. What, what, Explore, what's your recommendation? You know? I like today. This I wanted him to uh, hit a small bucket of balls with what we learned, and then go out and play alone if possible, just a few holes, and come back. 
Yeah, Tell me what happened. I don't so, like them playing with people, that's but if so they have to. That's so healthy to play alone, and too bad it's a lot of people don't, but it's so healthy for, so your, healthy. Golf, so yeah. healthy for your golf game. Yeah, and, it's, and I think, you know, so there's a lot of instructors that, or people listening might think, well, they're, they're losing out, I'm losing out on money or something like that. And it's, that's not the case. It's not the case. I don't want to take all the money I can and just cram. So, it, but, it, but it's also, there's a conversation mm-hmm. why. <laughs> I'm not just saying no. Right. I get that request often, you know, can, that's how, can I come back, you know, let's do, once a week, okay, you know, that's, it, that's, it seems like that's what a lot of people want to do in their series of threes, that I ask them what, but right. as long as they're developing in time in between. But if someone came to me and said, three in a row, here's $250, I would like three lessons for the next three days, I would say no. Yeah, go ahead. Come well, back. I really like this scenario. Uh, my intermediates, once a year players, they'll come in for getting ready for a tournament. And they take three lessons or whatever, in like a month. And this is the scenario I like. They, half the time, they will come in and say, I said, did you get to practice? And they think it's an insult. And they go, no. And I go, well, on the positive side, I'm your personal trainer. And I like it that you didn't in this aspect because I don't want any, you know, too much. Right. So I like it when it happens. When they so say I don't, they didn't I want practice? To, I, want to pra- I want them to practice. I tell them how. But when they don't, my... My feeling is to them is like, great, because now we're going to get it right every time and you're not going to make error away from me. Mm. So I yeah, do, it's that. a positive spin. But and the, and just to be but you have a lot of people like that's not developing. That's just input and moving at the same time. There's no time for them to self-discover. They're getting input from you and they're doing it for 40 minutes and then they're gone. They don't do anything else. They come mm-hmm. back and they get input from you for 40 minutes, but there's no personal development time. So if they don't go out and practice, what are they doing? They're, they have fun spending time with Jim DeLobby. They couldn't be enjoying themselves. Anyways, uh, we have to go. Great discussion. Sorry, we, could, we got no, so good. fast. Show went back went by really, really fast. But really thanks, fast. Thanks, guys, for Thank your you time. Thank you, guys. Jimmy, thanks, thanks bud. Keep it on course. Love See you in a week Thank or so. Thanks, Gibby.